At first glance, with their Herculean stature and fluffy red coat, you might mistake a Chow Chow for a bear or a lion. These intimidating yet cuddly looking dogs are one of the oldest dog breeds in the world, dating way back to ancient East Asia. Their aloof demeanor lends them to be loyal and protective companions to their family, letting only a couple of friends in on their affections. In this video, I will show 11 facts you need to know before buying a Chow Chow. Let's start. Breed Origin In ancient China, the Chow Chow was used as a war dog, fighting alongside soldiers and for hunting down large game. Their heavy coats also allowed them to withstand harsh weather, making them great sled dogs. The breed was most commonly used as a guard dog, and their serious disposition leaves little room for playfulness. Historians argue about whether this dog originated in China or Arctic Asia. Either way, the breed came out of East Asia over 2000 years ago. Their popularity bloomed once Queen Victoria adopted one, allowing the Chow Chow to eventually make its way west through trading ships in the 18th century. The breed finally made it to the United States in the 1890s. How much do Chow Chow puppies cost? Chow litters can range from 4 to 7 little puppies, with a Chow Chow puppy costing an average of $900. Although, high quality bloodlines can go as high as 6,000 USD. Coat color can affect prices too, such as how red is more popular than a cream coat. Chows typically reach maturity at 1 to 2 years of age. At 8 weeks, a puppy should weigh between 4 to 9 pounds. Chow Chow's temperament. They grow out of their puppyhood very quickly, lending them to be less playful than other dogs. They are not very welcoming to strangers, which can be an issue if not socialized enough. Chow Chows are also known for their deep, loud bark. This is one of those breeds that would be considered cat-like. Chows are also known to be very stubborn, making training very difficult. It is important to have a consistent approach. Owners will need a lot of patience when working with this dog. Appearance of a Chow Chow dog the Chow Chow can be easily identified by their fluffy body, the curled tail, and iconic blue-black tongue. Their outline is square in shape, their large head and straight back legs give them even more of a rigid definition. The stiff definition and posture makes them walk with a stilted gait. How to groom a Chow Chow Regular grooming appointments will be required to maintain a healthy coat. At home, you will need to brush them 2-3 to three times a week while taking special care to clean the wrinkles on their face. Care for a Chow Chow dog Caring for your dog is relatively easy considering their large amount of hair. Some Chow Chows are prone to food allergies, so be aware of what commercial dog food you are buying. Consult your vet if it becomes an ongoing issue. What do Chow Chows eat? This dog has a feeding routine that is a little more complicated than most breeds. They are prone to allergies, specifically in the skin, which are triggered by eating a lot of meat. For every pound of their ideal body weight, the Chow Chow needs one gram of protein every day. The spreed should be fed half of their food in the morning and the other half at night, allowing them to get a steady stream of calories throughout the day whilst avoiding the dangers of bloat. How to train a Chow Chow Training this breed is the hardest part about adopting them. They are a stubborn, proud animal that prefers to think for themselves. A consistent, experienced parent is needed to train a Chow Chow. This will help to bring them from thinking everything is a threat to being confident in their owner to take control of the situation. Positive reinforcement with treats and consistent application is the best way to train this dog. Health Concerns Allergies are the most common illness this breed can suffer from, whether they be food or skin allergies. They are also prone to eye issues, hip dysplasia and thyroid problems. How much exercise does a Chow Chow need? The Chow Chow is not a very active breed. A long walk every day is enough for them to stay fit and happy. When walking with your dog, never take them off leash unless you are in an enclosed area. Their aggressive temperament is too unpredictable to trust they will stand down from guarding without extensive training. Are Chow Chows aggressive or dangerous? This breed is not for families with young children or other pets. They tend to be aggressive towards other dogs that they are not raised with, but they excel at being a livestock guardian out in the field. Younger children, who like to poke and prod at the family pet, are not the best for this breed because they like their personal space. If I missed any information, let me know by commenting below. Thanks for watching this video. You are invited to watch more videos and subscribe to our channel for more updates. Thank you.